Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today, we are reading all four volumes of Heartstopper. As we all know, Heartstopper came out on Netflix about a month ago and I've watched it multiple times. Recently, they announced that a season two and three of Heartstopper is coming. Ever since I found out about that, I've just wanted to read the original comics so bad. I'm so excited to read all of these and find out more about Heartstopper and get myself ready for seasons two and three. I've just finished Heartstopper Volume 1. I read this in 30 minutes. I just wanted to talk to you guys about the comic. It's incredible. It's just like the TV adaptation. I feel like the TV show was done so well. I've never read a comic book before and I will say it's a little bit confusing to differentiate the characters. Even though they're all drawn completely different, I'm just not paying enough attention because I'm trying to get through it because I wanted to read on and on. I think this one also is all in the Netflix show. I'm gonna go outside and I'm gonna sit in the sun on the decking on the sofa and read my comic. These comics are literally better than I ever expected them to be. I just finished reading the second one and it's now 20 past eight. So that probably took me like 45 minutes. They're just so good. Like I'm actually obsessed. I'm beyond excited to read volumes three and four because I don't know what happens in them. I probably could finish them all tonight if I really wanted to, which I do, but I've decided that I'm going to save books three and four for tomorrow. I know that tomorrow me will thank myself for it and then I can spread out the experience and not read all four volumes in one sitting. But they're so good and I'm so excited because in volume three they go to Paris. It is time for Heartstopper Volume 3. I have heard that this volume and the fourth volume explore some more challenging topics. I'm not really sure what I've signed up for, but I'm so excited. Before I read this one though, I do just want to say that last night I was in the best mood. I think it must have been the comics. I don't know what happened to me, but I was so happy. We have landed in Paris. This comic is so emotional. I'm not being funny, but this one is a lot heavier than the others. Mood. Fun fact, this is in the Louvre and I had a panic sack like right there. I've just finished reading volume three of Heartstopper. This one was definitely harder to read. Not as upbeat, not as jolly, not as... I don't know, it was quite emotional actually, but it was still so good. I just think that Alice Oseman is such a talented, what do you call it, like comic drawer. It just looks so cool. I am gonna read volume four later today because I need to get on and do some revision. I'm having a lunch break from revision. I'm finally gonna read Heartstopper volume four. I'm pretty sure this is the longest one. I have absolutely no idea what happened in this book. I 
have just finished reading Heartstopper volume four. I have finished the whole Hearts of the series. It says at the back of the fourth volume that a volume five is on the way. I don't know why, but I kind of just assumed that all of the books were out. But I actually think that this volume came out whilst season one of the TV Netflix interpretation was being filmed. I can't believe I've read all of these in less than 24 hours. All I will say is that if you pick up one of these books, you will not be able to put it down. It is really a one sit read kind of book. This was the best thing I've bought myself in such a long time. I feel like Heartstopper Volume 1 and 2, I enjoyed more. Last night they put me in such a good mood. I feel like that's because they're uplifting and heartwarming. I loved, loved the first two volumes. I also really enjoyed the third volume. I love that they went to Paris, but obviously as I mentioned earlier in the video this book was a little harder to read obviously also enjoyed volume four but i feel like this one was a lot more focused around charlie's eating disorder so it's a much heavier but my overall thoughts on this series are that i absolutely loved it i'm so glad i read all of them i'm so glad i bought all of them i feel like i've already forgotten so many of the things which i've read because i've read so much so i'm gonna have to reread them and take it all in all over again so 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 good and i'm so excited to see seasons two and three that is my opinion on the Heartstopper comics by Alice Oseman. I think she's so brilliant and I'm so glad that I read those. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys have read the comics or if you've seen the TV show, what you thought. I really hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please do give it a thumbs up and make sure you subscribe to my channel down below and I'll see you very soon for a brand new video. Bye!